Emritanj Tiwari asks, how to predict future behavior of girls when meeting them for the first time? Hey, by the way, you have a dope name. I can't remember it anymore, but I love your name. Here's the answer. You don't want to predict future behavior of girls when meeting them for the first time. A lot of guys that are studying dating on the internet, they tend to be the guys that are thinking too much. They're planning too much. They want everything to be perfect. This is the devil to actually being a charming person. In the moment, you want to be the type of guy that is able to take anything that's thrown at them and be able to twist it around and throw it back into the world in a positive, fun way. You cannot predict the behavior of what is about to happen with every person. There's millions, there's billions, there's an infinite amount of possibilities for what will happen on a date and how somebody will act. Instead of being able to predict, I don't want you to think about that anymore. I want you to be so comfortable with not knowing what's gonna happen and being ready for anything, negative, positive, the best tip I could give you for doing that is to join an improv class. This is, to me, the magic pill for being good at social skills. So if you can't work with me for my one-on-one -on -one mentorship program, the next best thing I believe is to take an improv class. Look it up in your town, in your city, and join as fast as possible and take it for at least a year or two. Your social skills, your ability to be able to deal with anything that's thrown at you, positive or negative, and bring it back into a positive, fun, confident way will just skyrocket to the top of the world. That's it for the today. Hey, in the comments, tell me, have you ever taken an improv class? Do you plan on taking an improv class? Do you think oh, what everything I'm saying is bullshit? I don't know, maybe it is. Tell me in the comments, baby boys and girls. Hit subscribe hit like and uh, that's it. I'll see you next time.